as a lot of you guys know, I'm a percussionist. I love percussion. That's I love right. the drums. I love stuff from different parts of the world. He's and also I hitting everything at any time. That's right, yeah. So hide your women. Hey, yo, hey, yo whoa, whoa. That. I didn't mean it like that. Ever pause. <laughs> well, all right, let's delete that. Nah, fuck it, leave it in. So basically, I love discovering percussion from different parts of the world. There, there's many, many instruments from India that I'm still not familiar with. And there's many instruments that we're quite familiar with, especially from African uh, uh, descent. And uh, because South America, a lot of our percussion ended up coming from African tribes. And uh, someone sent us this sort of videos of African percussion and Indian percussion. And they have like an instrument off. If okay, you like a percussion okay. of, I don't know how interesting this will be for most people, but it sure <laughs> as fuck will be interesting to me and I hope <laughs> to one of you. So let's reveal this. Carpal. Castañas. I know it's like castañas, but they're flat. They're yeah, so, not actual. They're actually not castañas. Because castañas are what? Like uh, like chestnuts. They're yeah, like they're chestnut they're nuts. shells. Shells. Yeah, they're not shells. Spanish. Very they, flamenco. They, they do. They use them. Yeah, m mostly just flamenco music, rumba. So I wonder where this part. Oh, oh. Looks Punjabi to me, but I don't know. I'm not gonna lie. The hype of this set, though. I'm not gonna lie, I've never seen this instrument be played in my life before and but I have I no idea what he's using either. I love I love the fact that it, it, it modulates the, the pressure of the cuero, como se llama? Um, of the skin. Yeah. When he presses down on yes. the body of yes, the, yes, yes. the drum, it, it modulates the sound of it. It's pretty cool. They are like the epitome of like, are you a drummer? Are you a drummer? You know, it's like, God damn, I could have gotten lost there, actually. <laughs> yes, this as well. Uh. What? Wow, no, but the crowd, though. That's a djembe, I think. So that, that's actually that, so that, fun. That, that, what the heck? that type of taka 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 is so difficult to do on a open palm like this. Yeah. You would have to actually, because I think they're hitting it with their fingers. I, I st it's still unbelievable. Because we have, we have to. It's like a single stroke, essentially. When you're playing with your hands, like a conga or a djembe or something like that, we don't have that. No, you don't have the. Extra. We have the taka taka ta, yeah. but we don't have the taka taka. You yeah. know, it's like taka taka ta. Like, you don't have the syncopated feel, yeah. Yeah, it's like they hit it with their fucking fingers. It, it is. See, it's always yeah, down, single down, strokes, down, and yeah. then he hits it with the. So, of the hands. Yeah. yeah. That's why I became so fascinated by Indian percussion and Indian percussionists, because their abilities for fingers is nuts. <laughs> Happy women. Oh, 
Also, I don't think that's a Dolak. That's something else. See? Yeah, it's like... Mate, it's the most fucking mind-blowing shit I've ever seen in my life. It's pretty cool. <laughs> so cool! What do you mean? It's literally like they're having a conversation. Yes. I love that. Yes. There is a story of a tabla player that I think is actually part of Hindi mythology, or it just might be of Hinduism in general, mm -hmm. where there's like a god that communicated through the tabla. Ah, Someone was explaining right. to me on a comment or on an email. Can't remember that well, but it, yeah, essentially it is like... It's like communication. Yeah, like yeah, obviously that's not a tabla, but that's... Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, give us some rudiments, yeah? That is so fire! Oh shit, we are so quick! My god, yeah, what I the heck fuck. is that? I, like, I, everybody's I, sitting on the floor having what? a freaking blast of a time! Oh, so, uh, uh, how the fuck did I not know this was a thing? A convention or something? And why am I not there? Because I don't know that many people that are into percussion like I am. What the fuck is this? Every time I talk about percussion, everyone knows it's like, uh, uh, here, here he go. goes again. It's just a bunch of... You know, God damn! Oh my God. That's an empty water. Bottle. Yes. Container. Yeah. Now that's a djembe. And that's a cajon. A cajon, yeah, a cajon. Eso! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> they fucking put a. Oh, they can all play tabla though, because I can't do that. <laughs> I can't do that, genuinely. Yeah, no, I know. <laughs> I don't know how they do that. That shit. Yeah, maybe. Maybe like that. Yeah, In the best fucking yeah, Udupa <laughs> ticket incoming soon, <laughs> mate. Unreal. I mean, uh, again, I don't That's know. Really fun though, right? So it was Maestro Trilok Gurtu, a, a short clip from the Udupa Music Festival 2016, organized by Udupa Foundation. Uh, drums. Sivamani, Trilok, Gurto. I mean, they all say just drums and percussion, so I don't know who the fuck's who. Um, That's but um, dope. unbelievable. I know a lot of you guys know that I gush about this stuff. Uh, so thanks so much for sending all, all of this it's through. It's actually fun. It's actually fun to see you geek out. It's, it's awesome. 